Good morning, guys. I do not feel that good right now. I woke up with a sore throat, just feeling kind of down, not really feeling that good. And that kind of explains why yesterday my workout was like so unreasonably weak, why I just compared like squat like 225 for 10. So yeah, I honestly think I'm getting sick and like today is like fully starting to kick in. And due to me being sick, I wasn't able to eat much yesterday or like the day before. And my appetite's virtually gone today. So I weighed 185 this morning, which is not a good sign whatsoever, especially because there's like a photo shoot today. So I'm um, looking like a pencil, but that's what it is, unfortunately. It's 7.50 right now, 7.54. I'm going to be at Steve's house in roughly like 15, 20 minutes. And then from there, we're going to go to the bus station and... We're gonna go to New York. I finally figured out where Steve lives. Took me a little bit. The GPS coordinates weren't that accurate. So, <laughs> as you see, Steve's wearing uh, one of the new Gymshark it's hoodies. It's outside right now. I, I put a red one on this morning too. I thought it was gonna look really sick and stuff. I was excited to wear it. Then I got outside. <sighs> it was too humid and hot. I could not do it. So. Way too humid. I should have worn this, but I legit came out for like one minute. I was like, holy shit, it's way too hot. Way Steve. Too hot. You're literally walking on sunshine right now compared to me. I literally woke up with a bowl of this morning and I'm gonna be in a hoodie. First meal today is gonna be this little pack of pretzels. Yay! Monsters. <laughs> Second Wawa trip today. 30 minutes to get on the bus, so I'm not getting anxious right now. We better make it on time. Off season getting fat. It's 8.33 right now. I do not know where we are whatsoever. I don't know how far we are from the bus terminal. Steve apparently says it's 15 minutes, but I don't trust Steve. <laughs> Steve I'll get there fast, dude. If we don't get to the bus on time. I mean, there's no photo shoot. No, 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 Steve. If we don't get to the bus on time, Steve, you got to go through the stress of driving up to New York. So, Steve, you live by an airport. Did you know that, Steve? Did yeah. you know that you live by an airport? Yeah, That's a no fly zone. Forget about having a drone, Steve. <laughs> All right, guys, we're at, we just hit some traffic. This is that's a terrible sign. It's not looking good, guys, at all. Damn. I mean, we're still, we're still way early compared to um, the time the photographer. If I, the photographer wanted us there at like one, so we've got a lot of time. Even if we have to make the drive up there, that shit would suck. Bad. <laughs> Damn, I'm so happy. I'm not driving. See, we just make it there on time, Steve. Just fly over these cars. All right, guys, so. Me and Steve just missed the bus. We sprinted full speed to the bus terminal, literally sprinting, and we watched the bus leaving. Yeah. Since Steve does cardio on a regular basis, he made that final sprint just running up to the bus like, like when it was at the I light, the and we were just like, it. nope, and they left. Literally, if we came like one minute earlier, we would have been fine, so. Now we're going to Bally's. Now, the lady told us that we have to go to Bally's, which is a different casino. It's 88 degrees. And my friend Steven CAO is wearing a hoodie, a hoodie and long sleeve pants. Someone please escort him back to his tree. There's a lot more premium than the other one. All right guys, we're currently sitting at a different casino. Bus should come in 840. We confirm that we're at the right entrance, at the right like exit or whatever. So 940, hopefully the bus should come and take us to New York. It's 913 right now. Steve's changing out of his um, winner out of his winter outfit. He forgot that we're not going skiing. Check this stuff out, I'm sure. Oh shit. Oh, the Phantom series? This is it, right? Yeah. No, it's not, these are hoodies. Those are hoodies what is this? Oh, Ben was wearing this tank. Okay, oh, wait, no, it's not a tank. Ooh, let me see that. Currently eating my chicken Caesar wrap. Jailbreaking Steve's phone, he's turning into an absolute boss. We are successfully aboard the bus. We made Steve, you guys. Steve and Sadie are right there. So it's about 10 o'clock. The bus was 10 minutes late. See, why did this bus have to be 10 minutes late, not the other one? We would have been halfway there by now, but yeah, we're about to depart in probably like 10 minutes, and we'll see you guys in New York. Right now 
now we're about to find a shoe store because they specifically said either a black or a white pair of shoes. And we're about to buy a pair of shoes just for the shoe and then. Dave searching for shoes. Found a quick pair of shoes, we're waiting for them to come out, and then we're gonna watch the third shoe. So, really quick decision. Making the purchase for the shoes. Yeah. Some... Yeah, he is. He's a lead model. Yeah. We're actually about to do a photo shoot. <laughs> no, seriously, no, wait. <laughs> this is actually pretty nice, though. Walking in his new shoes. This morning when I woke up, I was a solid 16, now I'm 6'5, so I'm yeah. small now. Now I'm over here like 5'10. Alright guys, we met up with the photographer, Tommy right here. We've been talking about color grading for the past, like ever since we like hooked up with him maybe like an hour ago. And we're on the, what bridge is this again? William? Williamsburg. Williams Bridge. And fuck, Williamsburg Bridge. I'm screaming right now, but yeah, we're gonna find a location. Me and Steve are ridiculously drenched in sweat. We're gonna put on hoodies, get even more sweaty, go jog around and get some pictures. In that cardio in. Get that cardio in that I do once a year. Yeah, let's go. Severely dehydrated. We're at a 7 Eleven right now. Get something to drink. Also, milk. <laughs> Steve, you're funny. What? Some watermelon drink, two Evians, and a little fruity poopy punch. So hot outside. Dave and the photographer went to go shoot. Now I'm here watching the bags. Feed your water. Yeah guys, there's an inbound thunderstorm and it just started drizzling and 
me and Steve are, I don't know, maybe like 30, 40 minutes away from like our bus terminal that we have to take home. So we're just finishing up shoots in the rain. Last side of the shoot. Let's get it done. Alright guys, the shoot's officially a wrap. We finished off. This is our last location right here. We just started thundering out. And then right now, me and Steve, before we actually go home, take the bus home, we're gonna stop by a B H Photo, the big superstore in New York City. And that's like where I order all my little gadgets off of all my cameras, my drones, all that fancy shit. So we're actually gonna visit the store itself, which I can't wait, so. Alright guys, so we just said bye to Tommy. Turns out he's gonna go in the UK World Tour, which I'm gonna go to too, so I'll see him then. And yeah, overall I think we got some really, really good shots. We can't wait to see him. Very good shots. Very good shots. So yeah, right now we're at Subway. See, what do you Sub. got? Got a foot long cheesesteak. Um, it's plain. Having eight all day, so it should be good. Alright, I got, let's see, Italian roll, chicken breast, American cheese, lettuce, onion, tomato, cucumber, and Caesar dressing, along with three chocolate cookies. Let me see. Yeah. So that's that. Time to binge. It feels so nice to just sit down and relax. That was exhausting. Finish Subway, now we're going to go back to the bus terminal. Steve's going to get a few snacks for the bus, and then hopefully we'll just get a bus ticket and go home. Yeah. That's a line for our bus that we have to pay extra for. How do you feel about that, Steven? How does, your, how, does your, how does your bank account feel? Mine's feeling real empty, how about you? Mine's feeling real empty. All right, guys, we just got home. We just got off the bus. We're currently walking to the parking garage where we parked our car. And we had to take like a sketchy, weird bus because our normal bus that we should have took in the Greyhound, which is twenty-five dollars, literally straight to New York, uh, straight to New Jersey, which is a quick two to three hour drive. We had to spend like forty bucks each, get on a weird bus, like at some weird section, at like some weird gate, and to stop at like Tom's River first. The bus was packed. It was like mad. Every yeah. single seat was taken, right? Every single seat. And like the, the entire middle row, everyone was standing, just completely glued together, standing, and it took so long to get there. So from waking up at seven to pick up Steve, it is now 11:16. So that was the entire day, super exhausted. My throat started hurting so bad on the bus because I'm sick right now. Like and it is drink, horrible. And you couldn't drink water because there's so much people on the bus that like there's no way you're gonna be able to bath it. <laughs> oh yeah. Like on the bus, like I just like knew there's no way I can drink water because like I said, the whole middle row, like the whole, the whole middle row was full of standing people, so forget about going all the way back to go to the bathroom, so yeah. Steve, I want to go home, I want to go in your car and feel safe and drive home. Hi, how are you? What's the wrap on the day, Steven? Uh, it was fun. Pretty tiring. Uh, I mean... Oh no, the photo shoot was pretty fun. It's a pretty good experience. How about you? <sighs> Considering the fact that I have Ebola and the swine flu and a tapeworm, which I just found out that I have this morning, it was so humid out. Oh yeah, it was a lot of traveling. It was so humid out, just literally running around everywhere. It was very, very exhausting, but I think the pictures turned out really good. We can't wait to see him. Yeah. So yeah. Shout out to Tommy. Shout out to Tommy. Great photographer. Very good photographer. Really nice camera. He, uh, I begged him to justify me buying the camera that he has, and he did a pretty successful job. So we'll see how that goes. But yeah, gonna go home, see how the footage looks. Where are you going, Steve? Why don't you take the highway home? I'm gonna take MLK faster my house. Oh, shit. All right. Can you take a shower? Oh, God. I'm taking three showers in a row. It was bad. Dude, we were legit walking all day, sweating, right before the shoot. <laughs> Each location, drenched, wearing was, hoodies. I think it was one of the humidest days like, of the year. Like It was, yeah, it was, it was really pretty hot. bad. I had this weird thing like on the way home in the bus. Like Every time I would swallow, I literally feel this like clicking in my throat. I mean, you're getting sick. You're sick, dude. It clicks when you get I sick? I think so, yeah. You're like... No, my throat is like sore, but this actually clicked when I saw it, and I got very scared. So, I got Ebola or something, dude. Okay, I go doctor. <laughs> yeah. 
So now you'd be good, dude. It's probably because you didn't have enough sleep on top of that. You've been walking around all day. I think it's the swine flu, Steven.